Welcome to this unboxing video of the XI410 camera. With the XI410 series you have a camera solution with a direct Ethernet connection for distances up to 100 meter between the camera and the PC. And you have also the possibility to forward the temperature information and alarm states via a process interface as analog or digital signal to your process which could be a PLC or a signal indication. The camera can be also used in autonomous mode. This means you don't need any connection to your PC to forward the temperature information or the alarm states. Now let's unbox the XI410 and have a look to the scope of supply. If you open the package, you can first see the XI410 device with a mounting bracket and a mounting nut. And below you can see the Ethernet PoE adapter. On the other side of the package you can see a process interface cable which includes a connector block and which has a length of one meter. Below you can see an USB cable which has also a length of one meter and here you can see the USB stick which includes the complete analysis software of the PixConnect software. Last but not least you can also see a quick start guide which shows you the first steps of the installation of the XI410 camera. There are three possibilities to do the hardware installation of the XI410. First you can connect the XI410 direct via an Ethernet cable with your PC. Regarding this case you have to power the camera via the process interface. The second possibility is that you can connect the camera direct via an Ethernet cable with your PC and using the stackable process interface. Regarding this case, the camera gets the power supply also via the process interface. The third possibility is that you can connect the XI410 direct via the PoE adapter with an Ethernet cable and a managed PoE switch with your PC. In our video today we are going to connect the XI410 camera direct via the Ethernet adapter and the PoE switch to the PC. First connect the XI410 camera with the Ethernet PoE adapter. For the installation you need Ethernet cables to connect the PoE adapter of the camera with the PoE Ethernet switch and the PC. We are using for this installation a managed PoE Ethernet switch. Connect one Ethernet cable to the Ethernet PoE adapter and the other side to the managed PoE Ethernet switch. Connect the second Ethernet cable from the managed PoE Ethernet switch to the PC. We are now ready with the hardware installation. Let's have a look to the network settings. The handling of the IP addresses is very easy. Regarding the factory default settings on the XI410, the camera has the IP address 192.168.0.101 and the IP address for the PC is set to 192.168.0.100. There are already the factory default settings in the PixConnect software, so there is no need to change the IP settings in the software. The port address is always 5101. As you can see, the last three digits are the same IP digits of the camera. In order to communicate with the PC, we now have to set the IP address in the network settings on the PC. Let's have a look how to configure the IP address in the network and sharing center. For this, Open the network and sharing center on your PC by clicking on the network icon on your desktop task line. Click on the Ethernet connection. Click on the button Properties. Mark the line Internet Protocol version 4. Click on the button Properties. Activate the item using the following IP address and enter the address 192, 168, 0, 100. Push the tab button on your keyboard to fill out the subnet mask. 
click on OK and close all windows. Now let's have a look to the software settings at the PixConnect software. Make sure that you have installed before the software PixConnect on your PC. For this, use the USB stick. Now we start the software PixConnect. After you have started the software PixConnect, go to the menu device and activate the item Enable Ethernet. If you install the XI410 camera for the first time on your PC, a firewall window opens. Activate all items. Now click again on the menu devices and select the XI410 camera. The calibration files will be downloaded automatically. That's all. Now you can see the infrared image on the screen. To forward the temperature of a measured area as 4 to 20 milliampere signal to a multimeter, we will additionally install the process interface cable at the XI410 camera. For this, we already prepared and connected the USB interface cable with a USB power supply and with a multimeter. Let's have a look to the software PixConnect, how to do the settings to forward the temperature of the measuring area 1 via the analog output channel of the process interface to the multimeter. Go to the menu Tools Configuration, click on the tab Device PIF. Select in the pull-down menu of the analog output the item Measure Area. Click on the button Setup. Select in the pull-down menu the measure area 1 and set the output ranges for the temperature and the milliamp output. 0 degrees C equals 4 milliamp and 250 degrees C equals 20 milliamp. You can also use the XI410 camera in autonomous mode. For this mode, activate the item using autonomously by device. Click on Apply and OK. Click again on Apply and OK. Additionally, you have to write the settings into the device. For this, go to the menu Device and set configuration to device. Now we can see the temperature information of the measure area 1 as 4 to 20 milliamp signal on the multimeter. Alternative, you can also define an alarm state as analog or digital output signal. So if we now interrupt the connection between the PC and the XI410, the camera runs now in the autonomous mode. The multimeter shows still the right milliamp output signal of the measured temperature. As you can see with the XI410, you have an easy network connectivity and if you want, you can also run the camera in the autonomous mode without any PC. So in case of a network interruption, you will still have the right temperatures available. Mm -hmm.